at this agent time, we are still talking about Uga. Fulani S men clashes, uh, farmers' clashes have been one of the most disturbing problems to deal with in Nigeria. S men and farmers need to end the fight between them, in as much as we Nigerians exist as one and that herders and farmers improve the economy with their trades. As expected, the government is to provide a way out of the problem and it recently did. Those who have rejected Ruga and open raising may be forced to accept them within a few days, according to what someone is telling us. Whether he's speaking from, from the side of the government or on behalf of the government, we don't know. But with the way these s men have been going about unhindered, it shows that the government is not ready to save the situation. He said in his post that most convincing part is that open grazing, which the ESME can use as an alternative, has also been banned by some state governors. We opine that with the look of things, the government may force Ruga and open grazing on people who have rejected them within a few days because Ruga and open grazing are the solutions to herders and farmers' problems. He concluded in his post that we don't need the Minister for Information and Culture, Lai Mohamed, to inform us that Ruga and open grazing are the solutions. I don't seem to understand why those that have rejected Ruga have rejected it. The most convincing part is that the open grazing that S-Men use as an alternative has been banned by some state governors. With the look of this, government or governors may force people who have rejected Ruga and open grazing to accept it because these two ways are the solutions to the farmers and S-Men crisis. The Minister of Information and Culture don't uh does not even need to inform us this before we know ruga and open grazing are uh, the solution well the government should know that most people don't want both ruga and open grazing and should cancel both going back and forth uh by their long body language by their foot we shall we shall know them we know what they stand for why aren't you doing the Ruga in your northern state if it is genuine? Why bordering the south with no land? I blame those who sit, who see it cow meat in the south. Can Igbos and Yoruba joke with meat? Oh, so it's only the Igbos and Yoruba that eat meat. Can Igbos okay joke with meat? So because they are eating meat now, they should be killed. A, 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 a meat is not supposed to be eaten in the first place. Let everyone begin to send out awful learnings from their communities no matter what it will take. Fulani do not have land. They can't come from anywhere to take what they never owned. They are not the only one that knows how to kill. If that is what they want in this government, then no one will listen to the government anymore. The government is irresponsible and backward. The most senseless old man always talk trash. Governments cannot force Ruga nor open grace nonsense on any state. They should go to the north or northern states where they have enough land don't they have enough land there to do it period if the foolish minister wants it done compost really he should give out his cara a eh, quara state for it that man is not a serious person he's referring to lai muhammad the problem of nigeria is that eh, we have two sets of people the civilized one and uncivilized one the later still want to continue their primitive way of life why in 21 century the civilized one which to move wish to move on with their decent life we are not one in nigeria this country need to be operated giving them your father's land for ruga first as good example then others will follow suit why can't you talk reasonably for once ruga should be practiced for where people real and rear their cows the southerners have their land for their businesses is nigeria government forcing the hisba police in the north to destroy the alcohol the southerners are selling yes they forbid alcohol but the money realized from the tax are used to develop the north that has ended if i understood the tax system just talks about but if the not, can someone help me out this person is a man s man agent and his plans will never work dead coward forcing that is backwardness in display by what i have read here ruga can be 
best practice in the north where there is massive land and in my candid opinion open grazing is a no 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 in any part of the country the way forward is in mechanized ranching which can be practiced in all regions as if per individual or corporate uh, corporate interest they know this you want to tell us that they don't need this where you go to london every day where does he go there so you just go there for not of course they have not even learned anything they don't learn anything he has been going to a hospital in london or he has doctors in in london for over 40 years and they did not learn anything for 40 years and you see the way they have been doing oh my god and you want to tell us they don't know anything about ranching or mechanized farming they don't know they don't know anything like that to do ranching you think you say that is just wickedness if what has been going to london for 40 years i mean having his doctor in london for 40 years and yet he does not even know how to have a good hospital shame shame on them the government should tell us who owns this house why can't they buy lands for their grazing that is a question people have been asking for time immemorial time immemorial people have been asking for that why can't they buy land why must you seize farmlands of people for your personal gains the fulanis in government own these cows never mind the northern demons because all their evil plans have failed of course people are not longer sleeping this time around tell the man is a cow dung it's a call for all to prepare for the impending war. People should watch their back. There is no smoke without fire. The cross carpeting of Southeast politicians of Southerners to APC, who will be OES members to Buhari's order and directives, may not be unconnected with the boosting of enforcement of Ruga on the Southeast. The truth is that you can't be killing people and expect them to give you land. <laughs> Even if you're not killing somebody, you just want to they'll just be giving you land for what for what killing them and tell them not to cry open grazing is forever closed by the hand of the almighty god ruga rugbunu de liar muhammad you are here again to talk rubbish start from your home data say no to ruga and open grazing this lie is smoking weed it should go for psychic test before it will get out of hand yes it's it's it is their plan federation once said it what are you keeping your land for is the land more important than your life why can't you give them the land just like that and somebody's telling us that he's doing his job so guys let's hear your opinion and know your thoughts on this